Right, so Harry, nil nil draw on Saturday. Looks like it could be a step in the right direction. Yes, definitely. Um, considering the gaffer's only sort of been in two days before the game, um, didn't really have much time to work on stuff. So you you could definitely see the way we, we were trying to play football. There's, there was definitely steps in the right direction. Yeah, we had some good chances early on. If one of those went in, it could have been a different different scoreline on the day. Yeah, uh, it seems to be that's the way it's fallen at the minute. We can't seem to uh, take our chances, which is disappointing. But I think when it when it when things like that happen, uh, you just got to keep working hard, plugging away, and hopefully one will turn and, and, and your fortunes will change. Uh, Ruel Soterio has been on a good run recently. It must be nice to see him amongst the starting eleven again. Yes, definitely. Listen, Sully's a great player. Um, probably a little bit unlucky under the previous regime. Um, didn't get enough uh, chances, in my opinion. But but listen, he's he's had a chance the last sort of three or four games, and he's t uh, taken it. So um, hopefully his form continues, and we can uh, sort of steer clear of danger. And there seemed to be a quick uh, quick change in style of play. How has the squad dealt with that transition? Yeah, I think it's uh, it's an enjoyable one. We're we're looking forward to it. Um, like I alluded to, the gaffer and PT had only been in sort of Thursday, so they only had sort of one full day to to sort of work on their ideas. But um, it's it's not it's not going to happen overnight. We're not going to sort of just play like Man City from now on. But um, I think there's definitely positive signs of how we want to play football going forward. And and I can only speak on my behalf. But being in and around the lads, the lads are loving it. And yeah, we're looking forward to the future under the gaffer. Absolutely. And personally, how have you felt around uh, Richie and uh, Paul Terry? Yeah, um, again, I think I listened to Tomo's interview last week and I can just sort of say what he said as well. It's, it's a breath of fresh air. Um, I think we've got to pay a bit of credit to Matty as well. Um, he come on, uh, come in sorry, at a difficult time and, and took charge of three games. And um, Although we didn't get a win for him, which was disappointing, um, one thing he did do is, is get the group back together, which was which was needed. And obviously with, uh, with the gaffer and PT now, um, like I said, we're, we're thoroughly enjoying it and I'm really looking forward to the games coming up. Absolutely, and uh, on to Forest Green now tomorrow night. They aren't on the best runs at the minute, but it'll still be a tough game. We know what they're capable of. Yeah, of course. Listen, um, every team has, has a dip in, in, in the season. Um, I think luckily for them, they went so far clear at the first half of the season that they can probably afford a little dip. I think they're still... I think they're five or six without a win and they're still nine or ten clear, so it shows what a good start to the season they had. But... Um, Listen, um, they're on a difficult run, and we we don't want we don't want to be the team that that changes that. So we want to continue their misery a little bit, and we'll go there full of confidence and hopefully pick up a win.